I find myself fascinated by textures. So the photographs I take sometimes are not of any particular scene or person or object, but are just textures. It has an appeal to me, I suppose, because I'm a bit of a mathematician underneath. My name is Jeremy Dick. I'm a software engineer and an amateur photographer and a bit of a musician. As a kid, I was fascinated with something called the Fibonacci series. And the amazing thing about the Fibonacci series is that it's found in nature as well. And it just so happens that in many cases, the next layer of growth is determined by the number of elements of the previous two layers of growth. It is that simple. <laughs> I'm gonna get pilloried for my, uh, my mathematics now. <laughs> Keeping up with my wife, uh, not only in the field of jogging is definitely a challenge. What I like to do when we jog together is to make her believe that I'm at my limit and then when we get to the end I'll stretch out when she's not ready for it and catch her by surprise. I declare that there's nothing my husband can't do except for playing football. Yes. <laughs> she's so full of uh, energy that uh, she does very well. We also live very near to Her Royal Highness Kate, Kate Middleton. The Middletons live in the next village. And um, Kate and Pippa sometimes come and shop in our local Waitrose down in Thatcham. I've never seen her. Please don't put that in. <laughs> <laughs> we have five children, but we've ended up with two engineers and two artists. And my daughter is training to be a nurse. When I met my first grandson, I just suddenly understood, wow, here we go. I'm a grandpa now, there's another generation. and. Uh, it's a kind of eternal round. I went to Imperial College, specialized in the use of mathematics and development of software. That led me on to a postdoc position at Oxford, and the head of department had me come back to teach some modules on software testing. It was fascinating working with some of the top people and really doing some cutting edge stuff. Most of the important things in life can't be measured love and hope and faith. These are incredibly positive things. The scientist in me likes to find explanations. I find in faith explanations for things in life that otherwise would go unexplained. It doesn't worry me that I don't understand everything, or that I don't know everything. I have faith and hope that understanding will come. And I believe that that understanding comes through continuing to exercise faith. I believe that life continues after death. But I also believe that life existed before birth. And that puts my life between birth and death in an eternal context, which suddenly gives it meaning and makes it important what I do whilst I'm here. I'm a software engineer. I'm a musician. I believe the accordion should replace the harp in heaven. I love photography. I love to find patterns in life. I'm a husband and father, my name is Jeremy and I'm a Mormon. <laughs>